Welcome to Mountaintop Adventures. On this episode, we will be doing Wire Pass Trail. Make sure to like and subscribe to our channel as we travel full-time, cross-country, off-grid in our 27-foot camper. This is the beginning of the trail. Start out in the parking lot here. Pay six dollars per person, per dog. Um, we're with our good friends Austin and Rachel, and uh, I believe they said this hike was almost four miles. So it'll be. Uh, is this out and back or a loop? Nobody knows. We're just gonna wing it. <laughs> we're just gonna wing it. See, this is what I want. I know it's got to be that way. <clears throat> just a friendly note when you leave the parking lot trailhead you'll walk across the road you get over to a little um, riverbed go left go left young man so uh, we went right <laughs> and hiked and then we realized we we're going the wrong way so go left oh my God. just a hint <laughs> reached our first slot canyon. This is pretty cool. Wow. It's cool how it's like so rocky down in here. No, usually it's like flat and sandy. For the record, this ladder is not it. its not screwed to the wall or secured, so make sure you have somebody hold it for you. And uh, the last step is missing, so you have to step all the way down to the rocks. Um, and for people with short legs, yeah. it's kind of difficult. <laughs> Austin had to take Topher around because Topher is very squirmy and we couldn't exactly lift him up and let him down. Um, so Austin is working his way around the slot canyon and we are working our way through the slot canyon. So if you have a dog with you, just a note, there is a way around. On the opening. I'd say that was a quarter mile. That was cool. It's like Austin and Topher made it around. This right here is the slot canyon we just came through and they're coming up around this direction here. Watch them. Hi baby. It's like I got this. I got this. Yeah hi buddy. Everyone's accounted for. Second tight little slot canyon here. Yep. Cool. I'm going to throw the GoPro up to my wall. Gotcha. So 
Austin, Rachel and Taylor are down in the Slot Canyon and I'm on top of the Slot Canyon. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna see if I can find a way to climb down further ahead. Let's throw the GoPro down to Taylor. Got it. It's rough on the knees. <laughs> I thought that was going to be soft sand. No, it's itself. That sand is not soft. So this is our second slot canyon that we've come through. And once again, this one's probably about the same distance, about a quarter mile, but it's, the walls are so much taller. The ceiling is so much taller on this one. This is really, and it got so much more narrow. So the second canyon, <laughs> the second slot canyon is so much more narrow. Hey buddy. Wow, we got a big cave right there. So, trying to explain the massiveness of this is just, it's impossible. Like pictures, it's just like the Grand Canyon. Pictures and video just does not do it justice. It is so much to take in. Oh man. If you've never done wire pass trail, you should really do it. This place is absolutely gorgeous. Look at this, this big cave right here. Really cool spot. So we came out of our second slot canyon. It opens up into this big, pretty area. And so where we came from, it's back there. That's the second slot canyon we went through. And it looks like we have options. I think this is the end of the wire pass trail because it doesn't point any other direction. It says wire passes that way. So now we have this option over here and this option over here. <laughs> pretty much going to stay on the riverbed all the way till you get to the first slot canyon. Um, do not be fooled and jump off on one of these little rabbit trails because there's trails on both left and right and uh, they look really cool. Hey, get up in there, explore them, but just know that is not the trail. The, uh, the riverbed runs right into that first slot canyon. You can't miss it. Wire Pass Trailhead is the gateway to some spectacular scenery and hiking including the Wave and Buckskin Gulch. The trailhead is located in Perea Canyon Vermilion Cliffs Wilderness Area of Southern Utah and Northern Arizona, about halfway between Kanab, Utah, and Page, Arizona. As always, thank you for watching Mountaintop Adventures. If you have any questions, make sure to drop them in the comments section. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel. God bless and happy travels.